Good morning, welcome to my stable. I'm just back from the Wild Bad Weekender. I had a great time, never been before, got invited by Ian Judd and I camped, something I never do, Ian you know that, and um, it was really great. So I just thought I'd record a short video just to tell you what I thought of the event. So I rode up from Norwich, New Norfolk to um, Derbyshire and met uh, Ian and a couple of other mates. We stayed in a hotel the night before so we could get to the car museum the next morning really early, eight o'clock. So we got up, went and checked in. Um, it was a really well organised event. Uh, everybody was there waiting for us. <laughs> No. Uh, giving us a right wedge. <laughs> we didn't Ian. Put some tip on ones on. Yeah. got to look around the car museum as well, got to have some food, and then we went out for a group ride with everybody from Wild Bad. And oh my, there was hundreds and hundreds of bikes and people there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Hello again, here yeah, right. The group ride was really well organised, they used the drop off system. We were rode, riding around all the country lanes through a Ford, um, uh, around some really decent, reasonable tracks to, to have fun on and roads. And then um, we ended up at the campsite. Now the campsite was on a farm and it had uh, facilities there, it had really decent toilets, really decent showers. It had a, an events uh, marquee, massive, massive marquee. And it also had a number of people there selling coffee and food and things like that. So that, that was really great. The campsite was really great. It was in, in an idyllic area with a little bit of a, a lake there. And uh, what really uh, touched me was the actual place. Everybody there was super, super friendly. Can I dare I say it? There was no, no idiots there. The actual, everybody was really friendly. It did feel like a family. People have told me before, they've been before, it felt like a family. You know, everybody's out to help each other. Well, people were having trouble with odd bits on their bikes, you know, putting them on the stands in the, in, on the grass or whatever, and people were helping each other. And that was a really good sign for when we first arrived. We popped up the tents, we went and had a walk around. You could have a beer there, um, there was food, and there was a stunt show and, and things like that going on. A few competitions, slow races on your bikes, and also things like holding up your tires. And then in the evening there was music on. Now I don't normally camp as I said, but I really enjoyed myself because the facilities were good. Um, the people were great. And wherever you walked, people saying hello and having a chat with you. And I've just never been to an event where it's been so friendly. So the term family is probably the right term for that event. Would I go again? Absolutely. Would I do the group ride again? Absolutely. Um, have I made some friends being there? Absolutely. Uh, a shout out to Dan and Lucy. I spent some time with them. We met Dan at the hotel. We've probably got to meet up. He lives in my sort of area. So um, it sounds um, like I'm definitely going to go again. Definitely camp again. 
going to have some fun again. And uh, if you haven't been and you, you want to meet some people or you just love bikes and, and talk to people about bikes, it's a great place to go. Why wouldn't you? So that's my take on the Wild Bad Weekender. See you there.